What is your name? Sasha. Sasha? I'm Pascal. Okay. And where are you guys coming from? The Netherlands. The Netherlands. Netherlands. Welcome to Japan. Thank you. How long are you going to be in Japan? For another five days. Yes. So how many days in total you are here? Uh, Fifteen. Yes. Fifteen? Yeah. So you guys are on vacation? Yes. yes. So you are in Nara right now. Mm -hmm. Besides here, where did you visit? Uh, Tokyo. Tokyo. And from Tokyo, we went to Nikko mm. and also to Kamakura. Kamakura. We stayed in, in Tokyo, but we went out. Ah, like day a day trip. trip. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So after this, where are you guys going um, go to visit? To Osaka. We're mm. currently in Osaka, but Nara has a day trip for mm -mm. us. And then we'll do a day trip to Himeji. Himeji? Yeah, yeah. To see the castle? Yeah. <laughs> That's very nice. You went to Nikko, Kamakura, uh -huh. yeah. but do you have any specific plan or things to do over there? Mm, I knew from Nikko that it was just a beautiful area. Yes, with so nature. We have a lot of beautiful nature and mm. it was, so that's mm. very good. <laughs> and with Kamakura, it was more the cultural thing, mm. the history. It was quite interesting. And I mean, of course, the Great Buddha. The Daibutsu, right? Ah, yeah, the Daibutsu. But did you see the Daibutsu here as well? <laughs> no, not have, yet. Not yet. No, we walked past it, but it was really busy. Oh. And there's a lot of construction going on around Yeah, the... because this weekend they have food festival here. Ah. And they have music festival near the Big Buddha area too, ah, over the weekend. Right. Because this weekend will be the long one. Which city do you like? Did you like the mosque or impressed the mosque? Very difficult because I think it's all interesting, interesting in its like, own way. But each area has its each own perspective. Style. Yeah. yeah. Kyoto, we were in a ryokan. Mm. I've never been to a ryokan. Like Japanese yeah, exactly. styles. That was very cool. I liked it a lot. And we're more like to the east. Yes. Which is a nice mix of because you've got the mountains yes. and nature on one end, some temples, but you also have. The city like, life going yeah, on. Yeah, exactly. Very busy city like, life. Both sides, you mm -hmm. know, and that was nice. Uh, but I'm pretty sure if I went to the, the edge of Tokyo, I yes. would get a similar experience because then you also go to the mountains. So uh, I think to me it's the, the combination. City for me was a bit much mm -hmm. because we started in Ginza. Yes. And it's that, very city. That's <laughs> the city city. And all of our high brand shopping. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And very fancy. And we were near Shumbashi. Mm. And then if you go by train during rush hour, you're like... Yes, it's Whoa. hectic. It's, and it's very Last tough. night we went in Osaka to uh, Totombori. Um, yeah, Totombori, yeah. And it's very crowded and there's yes. lights and sounds yes. everywhere. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's, yes. it's, a very, it's, it's very cool, much. but it's intense. Which part of Netherlands are you guys from? And we're from like the, the west, near the Hague. Rotterdam. Rotterdam. Ah, yeah. okay, okay. Amsterdam Station. Yeah, it's also very busy. Yeah. Mimic Tokyo Station, the building itself. Yeah, they look very uh -huh. similar. similar, yes. similar yeah. right? Fun fact is, um, I think I've been to Amsterdam five times in my life. Ah. <laughs> 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 yes, yes. But what made you decide to come to Japan? Well, for me, the reason is a little bit different than for him because I have been a Disney nerd for a very ah, long time. Okay. So I really <laughs> wanted to see Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea. Did you manage to visit there uh, too? Yeah, we visited both parks two days. Nice. So that was really good. For me, it's just culture. Mm. Yeah. I yeah. mean, I like that too, obviously. Yeah, I, I knew, I, like, one day I had to go. So uh, it was in the bucket list. Yeah, it was in the bucket list for a very long time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So before you come here, did you search any information about Japan from uh, maybe internet websites or social media such? Yeah, and also friends. I had quite oh, a few friends, friends that have visited already, mm -hmm. so they could, could give me advice. And uh, I have a Japanese friend, so that also nice. really helps. Yeah. So you speak Japanese? Yeah, very poorly. So <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna try. Um, I'm always gonna say Mada Mada Disney. Like, and it's gonna... ah. <laughs> I'll try, but it's uh, it's very difficult. Yeah, <laughs> some simple kanji, but look, I can see the Shika Senbei, right? Ah, but it's like, but it's great. like, yeah, but it doesn't. It's not enough. And the joke is that sometimes I'm like really difficult. I'm like, oh, it says here that you're not allowed to cross this road and she's like yeah it's in english under there and i'm like oh yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> then sometimes you just didn't see the english yeah yes. exactly because <laughs> he's so focused on trying to read the japanese i'm like really but proud that's a good progress though i yeah, think it's it's, it it's fun progress you faster than you just rely on the english how about your food experience in japan Why? uh yeah we've tried quite a few things already and yesterday night we ate the takoyaki ah 
And today we ate yakitori. Yakitori. Omurashi. Omurashi. Oh, oh, omurashi. Oh, 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 <laughs> and um, the yakisoba. Yakisoba. And you had the little rice. Uh, you don't. A lot of a lot of uh, kombini onigiri. <laughs> ah, it's very convenient. Yeah, right? that's yeah. yeah, yeah. It's very helpful. You're like you you're tired mm. after, and you don't you want to go out to eat, but you don't know what to eat. Right? And you can just stop by yeah, convenience like, okay, store and grab some. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know it's gonna taste good. So. How about? Like in comparison of the convenience store in Netherlands, would it be any differences? Based on our experience, especially in Tokyo, but also um, around here, I feel like it's similar. Mm. Um, there is convenience on every corner and there's like small stores. Mm. We have fewer stores and they are bigger, bigger. more like a supermarket. Yes. Mm. Um, so people go there a lot just to do their weekly groceries mm. and then just go home. And here it's a lot more food to go mm. Gra just grabbing like stuff quick fix uh, to yeah. go. i feel that uh dutch people like to go cycling yeah <laughs> did you rent any of a bike out here N no not here but to, to us also in, in, in the netherlands bike infrastructure yes and car infrastructure mm -hmm. and pedestrian infrastructure are very separated yeah so you don't mix a lot mm. <clears throat> but in japan we were like in the first they few days we're like holy <laughs> Where are these people coming from, man? You're yeah. like confused, like, okay, where should I walk? And like suddenly this guy rides past you. You're like, oh, I didn't understand where, you know, it's really good. Even in Osaka, they decide to minimize the car roads, oh, car right. streets. Makes sense. And then give to the pedestrian and as well as the biker. So yeah, they are still nice. like uh, working it on. I think I would be scared to cycle in Osaka, but maybe in the area of Kyoto that we were in, yeah. Would that would be very like, there and it, especially quiet. in this weather, it it will be really very nice, nice yeah. to do it. Yeah, definitely. And, and what other important difference is? Yes. Like the Netherlands is really flat. It's uh, the yeah. flattest country in the world. Oh, there is no mountains. We have the, our highest mountain is 400 meters, I think. Oh, I was gonna say 200. So 200? I, no I know, probably. You're but right. nothing. <laughs> That's just the important. Okay. Not. Okay. You can look that up they if you want. It's a mountain, yes. but it's more like a, it's hill. a hill. hill. It's very easy to cycle because you don't have to go uphill. But if you mm. go into like hilly areas, you have to cycle up. What else impressed you about Japan the most? Infrastructure. Like, like a I people, was culture. Say public transport. Real, real infrastructure is very good. Yeah. It's really good. You have to and get used really to it. It's really clear. Like, of course, yeah, you have to get used to how it works. Mm. But as soon as you understand how the machines and the tickets or oh. the passes work and how the the signs work that say how much you need to pay for which stop. It's mm. so clear and the trains are always on time. <laughs> it says, oh, it's delayed. And it was like two minutes and I thought, oh, really? Are we putting up and a sign for this? And they still apologize you for the delay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and do you think you want to recommend your friends or family member to visit Japan? Oh, definitely. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Do you want to come back here? Maybe not too soon, but in the future? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I'd want to, yeah, there's still a lot of the country. Oh, and we, oh. we took the most the most popular bit in the center of, yes. the, the, I think it's that called the Golden Route. The Golden Route. It's like a Tokyo, Kyoto, Osaka. Ah. So that's very popular. Mm. But friends of mine, they went more north, northeast, mm. more, more southwest, and you really have different culture. Mm, mm. My, my, my friend is from the southwest. Yes. So she said, yeah, if you want to see really nice nature, you should maybe go there more because it's oh. more rural and a bit yes. more chill. Yes, and they have a lot of uh, hot springs. Yes. So, uh, yeah, I think next time we come back, maybe in another corner of the country. Mm -hmm. yeah. where, where are you from? In <laughs> I'm Japan? from here. You're from ah. here. <laughs> what, is, what is the food of Nara? Kaki no hazushi. Kaki no hazushi. Yes. Uh, it's like Nara is basically surrounded by the mountain we don't have any sea ocean whatsoever oh. so back in the day people wanted to have sushi but we don't have ocean so we cannot have a fresh fish right mm. so i don't know who decided to make it but they use persimmon leaves mm. to preserve sushi so that it will let it will last longer because oh. the leaf itself has a i think skills for the sanitized stuff mm. or keep it as well, uh, also solomon. It's very thin, mm. white color noodles, not mm. udon. It's very thinner than udon. Mm. Yeah, that's popular in, or it's local stuff in Nara too. Yeah, good to know. Nice. Mm. Maybe on the then way we back. Know what to look out for. And then a lot of tourists will stop by those mochi area. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> the grass mochi. Like the, the, yes, yes. Yeah. Yomogi popular. mochi yeah. and red beans inside. Yeah, azuki. Uh, so, yeah, so, so, yeah, so, yeah. you know it. <laughs> Uncle? Huh? Uncle. Uncle. Uh, yeah. Hi. I like That's it a lot. That's very popular. It's tasty. I hope you enjoy the rest of the trip. Thank you. Arigatou gozaimasu. Hello. Hello. <laughs> May I have your name, please? I'm Louis. Audrey. 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 And where are you guys coming from? Uh, San Francisco. And you guys are visiting Japan this time? We are visiting for the first time. Okay. How's your experience now? Uh, it's been really good so far. Uh, we've been in Tokyo mm -hmm. and in Kyoto. And uh, yeah, it's just been been a lot of new things. Uh, everyone's been super friendly. We've had a great time. How long had like you are gonna be in Japan? Two weeks. Two weeks. For two weeks, you be in Tokyo, Kyoto. Day trip to Nara. Uh, then we go to Kanazawa ah. and Takayama. So Kanazawa is for like a day trip, or you're gonna stay over there? We're staying there for um, two nights. They have nice seafoods there. I and heard. Sake. Sake? And sake, oh, yes, sake. Yes. yes, and the sake is really good, right? Yeah. Yeah. Why did you decide to come here? Uh, we both traveled to Asia to get, uh, a couple of times, but mm. have never been to Japan and had never been to Asia together. And so we've been really wanting to come back and it was high on both of our bucket lists. So uh, I finally made the trip and she just turned 30, so we did her uh, 30th birthday here. <laughs> Happy birthday, <Thank> you. <laughs> so while you were traveling here, is there anything to surprise you the most? It's very, very clean. Just how, just how friendly everybody is. Mm -hmm. um, everyone's been so friendly, welcoming, wanting to help us, you know, find where we're going and all, all that sort of stuff. But did you encounter any uh, communication barrier? You know, sometimes. In language, maybe? A, a little bit, but generally enough between uh, other people having a little bit of English mm. and pointing around at different mm. things, we're able to figure it out. The complicated thing for me has been figuring out the train system. Ah. <laughs> Nowadays, train station has each numbers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so yeah. I think you just got to look at it instead of the name of a station, the, yeah, especially numbers. for tourists, yeah. I right. think. That's right. That's what someone else told us. Mm. We've, been, we've been trying to do a little It'll bit better be now. It'll be slightly easier yeah. Yeah. to yeah. recognize yep. where you are. Totally. Right. How about foods? Food's been good. Um, she doesn't eat seafood, ah. so it's been a little <laughs> bit harder for her. Um, but we've been able to still find a number of restaurants between doing ramen, mm. uh, the different kind of chicken skewer mm. restaurants. Uh, Give me top three Japanese foods you have to try and it was the best. Probably ramen. Yeah. Uh, sushi, of course. Mm. Different kind of like chicken skewers have all been, yes. all been really good. Although like the matcha yes, ice cream. Oh, matcha yeah, the, yeah, ice yeah. Cream. Matcha ice cream, probably number one. Do you think you can find a similar Japanese foods in San Francisco as well? Similar but not as good. Mm. Uh, They're I'm, similar. It could be pricey. It's pricey it's and yeah, yeah, it's expensive in San Francisco. We do have, uh, we have Japantown in San Francisco. Yes. Uh, which we've gone to a couple times and they have a lot of Japanese food and stuff. Mm. So it is still all good, but uh, yeah, definitely not as good as it is here. Do you feel Japan is safe? Oh, it's been incredibly safe. safe. I read an article that San Francisco could be one of the most expensive, expensive. cities. New York is very expensive. Mm -hmm. And then San Francisco, yeah, right. it's crazy. Exactly. I hope you, you enjoy the rest of the trip and stay, pro stay safe from them. Thank you so much. Years. It was really nice to meet you. <laughs> Hello. Hello. What is your name? Uh, Diogo. And uh, Sami. And you guys are from? From Switzerland. Switzerland. Welcome to Japan. Thank you. Is this your first time visiting Japan? Uh, for me, second time. Huh. Yeah. And me, uh, my first time. First time. How's your experience so far? Japan is very beautiful country. Mm -hmm. and people is very good, chill, uh, good vibes. So this time in Japan, where did you go? Tokyo, mm -hmm. Kyoto. Kyoto, Kyoto, Osaka, and uh, Nara. For how many days are you going to be here uh, in Japan? In Japan? 20, 20, 20, uh, days. 20 days. 20 days. Yeah. So after Nara, where are you guys going? Uh, go visit? back in uh, Kyoto. Oh. The back in the after. After uh, Kyoto. Uh, Tokyo. Tokyo. Yeah. For the weekend. Yes, in the weekend for uh, one week in the, mm. in uh, Tokyo. What did you do in Tokyo? Uh, everything. <laughs> Shopping, mm -hmm. temple. What did you buy? Clothes. Yes. yes. Uh, Clothes <laughs> and sneakers. Mm. Figurines. 
before you come to Japan, did you search anything yeah, search, about search, Japan? Yeah. What to do here and there on social media? Uh, yeah, social did media. you like check Instagram? Check Instagram. So this is your first time in Japan, right? Yes. How do you like it so far? Do you like it here? Yes, I like. Uh, I really like uh, here, and uh, I good like uh, Kyoto. And, ah, okay. Uh, it's uh, from Kyoto. It's uh, beautiful, mm. and uh, I very like uh, clothes. Ah, uh, uh, the fashion. Yes, fashion. Yes. But Switzerland has a lot of uh, nature, same as Japan. Yes, oh, yes it's very nice, nice. for uh, for work. Mm. And uh, yeah, for uh, life, uh, working, uh, student, it's very yes, good. Yes, it's covered by government. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And uh, yeah, for uh, visiting, is good. Good. It's good yes. Could be expensive too. Yes, expensive. <laughs> so do but you find Japan was cheaper? Same, same. Mm. No cheap. Mm. No cheap in Japan. The transport is same, same. Mm. Clothes uh, here is, is uh, uh, no cheap. What? Foods did you try? You are in Japan. Uh, gyoza. Gyoza. <laughs> gyoza. Ah. Amazing. Gyoza. Uh, um, ramen. Ramen. Yes. Omelet. Japanese omelet. Yeah. Tamagoyaki. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Tamagoyaki. Beef. Uh, yes. Ah, yes. Meat. Steak. Yeah, beef. Meat. Yakiniku barbecue. Barbecue. Or meat. Yes. Mm -hmm. In general. Yeah, in general. Mm -hmm. Steak in general. Rice. I like rice in Japan. <laughs> ah. Do you think you can find the same items or similar foods in Switzerland? I have a, in Switzerland. I have a restaurant Japanese, mm -hmm. but no, it's no similar. Not yes. so good. No. Rice is not uh, not same. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, in Japan, is uh, mm. kitchen is a very wow. So, is there anything you surprised about Japan the most? Uh, These people. People, people. Is, yes. Nice, and, uh, <laughs> good person. Uh, enjoy. My mm -hmm. person is uh, yes. enjoy. Uh, Did you get lost? Oh, no. No? No, transport is very yes, good. good. Uh, Compared to simply, Switzerland? Uh, Switzerland uh, have a uh, good transport, but um, oh. in Japan have uh, yeah, a uh, lot, lot uh, transport. Uh, uh. Ten minutes have uh, uh. one train. Ten minutes is for this is uh, is uh, perfect. Do you think you want to recommend your friends or family member to visit Japan? Yes, yes. I recommend. <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, and please enjoy your stay. Ne? Arigatou gozaimasu. Ah, now you speak Japanese. <laughs>